I'm watching back another video. Today, the official Doors Floor 2 sneak peek is out. And I missed the premiere, as you can see, because I was too busy eating Subway. I don't like Subway, but I had some fire cookies. Um, but as always, if you watched at least three of my videos, then you probably like my content. So, you should hit that, that subscribe button if you feel like. And without further ado, let's just hop on in. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Y'all, something I want to say. Ah, ah, <laughs> the mind sneak peek. Everything shown is subject to change. Ooh. Ooh, this kind of looks fire. It's box man. Whoa. Hold on, hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I know it's a little bit early to put my interjections in, but um please make a seek chase out of minecart. That That was it. That That was it. That was it. <laughs> I think Creecraft will enjoy it. That was that 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 wasn't even long enough to consider a video. Thank. Rip. I wonder if uh, the minecart can deal damage. I do wonder. Yeah, that's all. That's all doors has to offer. So if this becomes a video, I guess that's about it around here. So how much about it was today? Official teaser trailer three. For Garden of Bad Band 7 is out. I don't know why, like, the whole bar is, um, is red. Because the only thing I did was click on it and then, like, copy the, like, copy the link and paste it into my thingy. Uh, and it's the third teaser trailer. I don't think we've ever had a third teaser trailer before. Teaser trailer? Yeah, no, we haven't had a third teaser trailer before. Okay, that's interesting. It looks like Bitter Giggle is split in half which is interesting especially since um like like before bitter giggle was introduced in four and you only saw the picture in three and you knew it was going to be in four um a lot of people were like theorizing that because he's two different two different sides he's going to split in half like and like have a mouth there and so i think they're just like doing more fan service you know which they do all the time but as always if you watch at least three of my videos then you probably like my content <clears throat> so you should hit that subscribe button i should also let you know i'm a little bit sick that's why my voice sounds like this um but without further ado let's just hop on into it oh my goodness we're in the trenches He's looking villainous. He's looking devilishly dis He looks like a devilishly despicable devious <laughs> evil man. That's it? Well, I mean, it's, it's cool, but still, that's it? That, that's it? Well, anyway, let's, re let's uh, react to that. Let's look it looks like we're in the trenches, and there's trash bags. And then Bitter Giggle's looking quite villainous, quite devilishly despicable, devious demon. Looking quite crazy. Look at his claws. Bro, he's buff. Look at look at the, the snake arm. He's buff. <laughs> cool. Well, I mean, I guess that's about it around here, so. How am I supposed to today? There's a new Ban Ban thing released. I know what it is because I started recording and then did realize that I w actually wasn't recording three minutes in. Um, which sucks because it was really interesting actually. Um, but before we, if we continue or whatever, um, as always, if you watch at least three of my videos, then you probably like my content. So you should hit that subscribe button if you feel like. And without further ado, let's just hop on in.
Ben Ben. Or Krupa, I should say. Or am I that spoiling too much? This is Flumbo. Boy, that doesn't sound right. Oh, this is Krupa. Wait, that also doesn't sound right. Ban Ban wasn't always Ban Ban. And I'm here to discuss with you the secrets of our beloved red friend. It's Ban gonna be so Ban much harder to talk because it's, the it's not the first time I heard this. And, personality. and that's what makes Garten of Ban Ban unique. Join me on the first yeah, episode it's Ty of Coker, the, by the Ban way. Ban uh, Chronicles, the narrated by me. Ty it's weird because it's like a mix between between the the Poppy Playtime secret things and a Matt Pat video, and it's funny. Ty Coker, the voice actor of Bitter Giggle, a series where we dedicate each episode to discussing the history and secrets of a member of the Garden of Ban Ban cast. Bun Bun. If you decide to go and sift through the game files of any Ban Ban game, you Minecraft. might notice something strange. You will find that, compared to most other characters, there are very few references to the name Ban Ban. This is because the name Ban Ban actually came very late into development. Very you will have very much better luck looking for files that reference the name Flumbo. <laughs> This is the first name that was given to our pancreas-loving red dude. And from there, what later became known as Garden of Ban Ban was once Flumbo and Friends, with Flumbo himself Art actually being the third character to be designed and sketched of the original six, not the first, despite later becoming I'm the main the first. character of the I've series. Seen everything. However, feeling Flumbo and Flumbo and Friends were two unremarkable of names, Flumbo was then renamed to Krupa. And from there, the Garden, Garden of, Krupa. of Krupa was born. A name that you can still view at older archives of the Steam page. But at one point a little closer to release, we decided to change the name from Krupa to a much more catchy Ban Ban. Appropriately resulting in the final name of this new game being Garden, Garden of, of Ban, Ban, Ban Ban as we know it today. A game called Garten of Ban Ban without any Ban Bans to be seen. Because as you might know, Ban Ban is actually absent from Garten of Ban Ban 1. But what if I told you that that wasn't always the case? And that the final game where you only meet Opila Bird and Jumbo Josh was the final version of the game script with two scrapped versions before it. With one involving just Stinger Flynn, I wonder Flynn, how just Stinger Flynn would work, like I'm Devlog, interested. And the other, and also very first, script involving only both Jumbo Josh again, and none other than Ban Ban himself. This I think version of the script this starts version's out pretty very similarly to the Garden of Ban Ban 1 that we know today. You enter Ban Ban's kindergarten as a parent looking for their missing child, and are subject to a few puzzles Pick that need to be to solved time. in order to proceed. Only this time, there would be no eggs to be collected for Opila Bird, since she simply wasn't scheduled to make an appearance in this version of the script. In place of Opila Bird, you'd be stalked throughout the kindergarten by Ban Ban, without ever getting- Which I think is a pretty interesting concept. I think that would be, like, a very interesting way to introduce Ban Ban. There's actually something very interesting later for Ban Ban 2 that they see. Um, which I think is also very interesting. Like, I wish I was able to record my first reaction if I realized I wasn't recording. Because, like, it is so weird to see. Getting a clear view of him. Think Opila Bird staring at you from behind the wall, only with Ban Ban, and it happening much more frequently. So, if there was no Opila Bird, does that mean that for the majority of the game you were supposed to just be solving puzzles while being stalked? Well, no, not really. With every version of the script came a new design for the map that would better fit the story. The kindergarten of the version of the script where you're being stalked by Ban Ban was meant to be much smaller, with the second half of the game taking place inside the actual facility. This is why if you watch one of these videos that fly around the map of Garden of Ban Ban 1, you may notice that there's a small room underneath where Jumbo Josh attacks you in the original game. He wasn't scripted to attack the elevator in this version of the script, 
instead you'd safely make it to the underground facility where you would continue to be stalked by ban ban for a little more for the most part this was ban ban's role in this version of the script and as for jumbo josh <laughs> I'm very interested to find out how Zumbo Sauce was using this. Like, very interested. Like, I cannot wait for that Zumbo Sauce video, because I am extremely interested in finding out what Zumbo Sauce was used for. Well, you'll have to wait for the Jumbo Josh Secrets video, where Jumbo Josh's role in this version of the script is revealed. Stay tuned for that. Jumbo Josh. Of course, Josh. as you may know, this was later changed to making the player first enter the underground facility in Garden of Ban Ban 2. The Euphoric Brothers felt that the ending in the final script where you get attacked on the elevator made for a much better cliffhanger. But what do you think? Let I think, yeah, it's a pretty good cliffhanger. Because I don't know how the other scripts ended because you never said it. Let us know your thoughts about this version of the script in the comments below. I'm going off script here for a second to say I will actually be looking at the comments about that. So let me know what you think. I'm very curious. Speaking of the Euphoric Brothers, did you know that Ban Ban is voiced by Geppo, the purple of the Euphoric Brothers? And like most of the other Garden of Ban Ban Geppo and characters that speak during the games, Ban Ban has some- And yes, I did. And by the way, why- why did they choose this, of all things? Why do they call it an oven when you of in the cold food and of out the hot eat the food? <laughs> why? <laughs> unused voice lines. Two, to be exact. The first was meant to be said in Garden of Ban Ban 2, where a mysterious voice over the intercom asks you to wave at a camera so that they know you can hear them. This mysterious voice, whom you later learn is actually Ban Ban, was originally meant to say a line if you take too long to wave at a camera. Take a listen. Please, I need to know if you can hear me. That's Could like- have said That's like great, they should have kept that line in, like that's, that's needed. Myself, Gepo, oh Buddy, oh, pal, oh, purple guy. <laughs> purple guy? Line would be That's said all. automatically by Ban Ban without the player prompting the conversation to start by doing a certain task. Because of this, there were too many things to account for, such as whether the player was in the correct room, among other things. Overall, it was causing too many issues, so it was just removed altogether. Unlike yeah, Ban Ban's second unused voice line, which was not added simply because the developers forgot to. Whoops! In Garden of Ban Ban 6, while accompanying Ban Ban in the Garden Statue's puzzle room, you will at one point open the door to the red cabin there. This causes a miniature naughty one to suddenly jump out of the red cabin and run away, which shocks Ban Ban. Normally, he says the following. Watch out. What is that doing in here? And that's where the dialogue ends in Garden of Ban Ban 6, but originally, he was meant to follow up on that sentence by this unused voice line. What even are these things? I think that would have been very interesting to, like, be in the game, but also kind of doesn't make sense, because I thought Ban Ban knew what the naughty ones are. I thought... I thought he did, but apparently not. If he would ask, what are those things? Well, Bitter Giggle knew, but... And Sheriff Toadster knew, but I thought Ban Ban did too, I guess not. It ends in Garden of Ban Ban 6. But originally, because Ban Ban knew Sir Dada do existed, so it would make sense for him to know the naughty ones existed. Finally, he was meant to follow up on that sentence by this unused voice line. What, what even are these things? This follow-up line yeah, I, I was never back implemented, a little bit ahead of the as trouble. mentioned before, because of an oversight. Truly unfortunate. Unfortunate. Ban Ban's unused voice line in Garden of Ban Ban 6, you will forever be remembered. Rip. Okay, so we've disclosed Ban Ban's role in early versions of the script and Ban Ban's unused voice lines, so now let's talk Ban Ban's model and art assets. While the Euphoric Brothers don't have any records that document exactly when Ban Ban's model was first created, Ban Ban's first ever render was created on October 4th, 2022, and it looked like this. This- He looks weirdly untextured. I know I said this the first time, but I wasn't recording, so. But he looks weirdly untextured. So I was like eight minutes in the video. That's sad. That's how long it took me to realize I wasn't recording. But anyway, he, look, I, he looks wrong on texture. Is the first time that the render is being revealed in full to the public. 
The head of this render was used as a placeholder for the game's icon up until it was replaced with the Jumbo Josh one we all know and love, back when the game was still called Garth Dr. Krupa. Duff Krupa. Additionally, this barely textured version of Ban Ban's model actually makes a more important appearance than just being the subject of some secret render. In one of the older screenshots of Gartna Ban Ban 2 before it came You're about to see something crazy. Came out. This version of the model can be- This- no! I don't know what it is about this, it just doesn't look right. Like, maybe it's just, like, Ban Ban leading you into the darkness even though he's chasing you. I don't know, just something doesn't look right here. Seen in it a just looks so weird. ...during a scrapped chase sequence that was meant to be in the game. This was scrapped very early on, though. There was also a time where Ban Ban was supposed to be given a guitar, but this was also scrapped. Now here's where I say the thing that I said when I wasn't recording, which is, in Ban Ban 7, like, if Ban Ban isn't dead, he should just, like, make his reappearance by, like, just sitting on a rock playing his guitar. Like, I think that would be, like, a fire way to reveal that he's alive. And if there's a Ban Ban 8, which I'm not sure there will be, there probably won't be, but I'm hoping there will, because I would prefer for it to end at 8 rather than 7, and it would make sense for, like, the naughty one's problem to be solved, like, longer than a, uh, than just one game. So, it's, like, it would end in, like, the 8th game or whatever. Um, but, uh, like, I think it would be pretty fire to introduce, like, he doesn't show up at all in 7, and then in 8, he just, like, he just walk around a corner... And, like, you hear guitar playing, then you just walk around a corner, and he's just sitting on a rock playing his little ditty. I think that would be pretty cool. Instead, we opted to show off this guitar in the hand-drawn depiction of Ban Ban in Garden of Ban Ban 3's cafeteria. Who knows? Maybe this guitar will have more importance in the future. Yeah. Speaking of... You hear say, yeah, after it says that, who knows, maybe it'll have more importance in the future. I think that's confirmation that it's going to have more importance in the future. And this is about the time that I realized I wasn't recording. Scrapped concepts and going back to the earlier versions of the script of Garten to Ban Ban 1, there is an art asset that was meant to have been written by Ban Ban. At some point during this early version of the script, you were supposed to come across this Turn ominous back. message that says, Turn back. That was written in ketchup. <laughs> Obviously ketchup. There was also this scissors icon that was meant to be for an item that was part of a scrapped puzzle that involved Ban Ban in Garden of Ban Ban 1. But Interesting. wait, what's this note? Stay tuned for the next episode of the Ban Ban Chronicles, where the secrets and history of another character will be revealed. Comment down below which character you want to learn more about next, and keep on Ban Banning! Ban Ban. Ban Banning? Is that what people say? Right? That sounds, that sounds by, right. Uh, I think that's Jamie a verb. Ban banning? Revived, whatever it is. I'm, uh, hey, honey, I'm going ban banning. <laughs> I'll be back shortly. All right. Um, That was very interesting. Very, very interesting. Why is it still going? Why? Hold on. Is there something secret here? Why is it still going? Why? Why is it? All right. Um. Yeah, I'm going. Anyway, next. I want to read next that note to see if it. I plan to sneak up on you and hit you very hard while you're occupied with reading this note. No, it's just the same one. Just the same note. Well, I guess that's about it around here. So, bye. 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 bye.